Yeah bro, nice acting skills. All you did was spawn in the submarine and then you just put it under my chili head, bro. Nice work faking your videos, bro. Now you lost the sub, bro. If you keep this up, you will lose a lot more. Keep it up. Alright, alright, alright. Stop. I got a lot of comments on my last video. Apparently people thought I was faking my videos. I don't fake my videos. I spawned in the multiplayer maps in Grand Theft Auto single player. Those are the exact locations from GTA 5 online. I didn't place a submarine just on the Mount Chiliad. No, Rockstar Games did that. And I was kind of shocked that instead of finding a submarine underwater, I actually found it under Mount Chiliad. But wait. What? What? Wait a second. Are you? What the? That is so weird. Why is the submarine right there? You would think that the submarine is somewhere out there in the ocean, right? But it's actually underneath Mount Chiliad. And that was my life reaction because I was like, damn, there's not even water over here. But Rockstar Games is good at tricking you guys and tricking me, apparently, because they put things in locations where it isn't like where you think it is. For example, and this is the simple like explanation right here. For example, North Yankton. If you play the first mission in North Yankton, you got a snowy map, right? Where is that snowy map? That snowy map is actually somewhere above the water it's somewhere above the water in the south side of los santos from north yankton you actually can see like los santos right here and it's even hovering above the water right here now this is another location where you wouldn't expect it to be so i got more location and more tricks like tricks by rockstar games in this video which will like maybe mind like blow your mind and like I got shocked by a couple things that Rockstar Games actually do in their game. In this case right here I got shocked a year ago. This is the mission Minor Turbulence where Trevor has to take over the cargo plane while flying a crop duster inside. He takes over the cargo plane and then Rockstar Games use a special effect a optical illusion let you believe that this cargo plane is flying all across Los Santos but it actually is sitting there at the exact same location letting you believe that's actually flying over Los Santos but it's in the exact same location with a lot of smoke and a lot of things happening around you oh my god yo we are right now on top of the freaking cargo plane it's flying towards what what it's oh, what what is going on okay so wait we are we are at the same we are at the same spot we are not even flying what is going on there is oh my god yo check out the smoke right here it looks like we are flying but we are not that's so crazy on to the next one, I thought I would bring this one up. This is the silo with the nuke from the Doomsday Heist. Right now, in your GTA 5 online session, you actually can find this hatch right here from the silo. You would think this is the hatch from the silo. I got a lot of questions from you guys. Like, what is this thing right here? Well, it's actually the hatch from the silo, but it lets you believe that it's the hatch from the silo. It's not actually placed right here. The silo is actually placed all the way down on a different location at Mount Chiliad. There's nothing right underneath this hatch right here. I'm going to show you guys it right now. So right now, like this is a silo with the nuke. And I'm going to show you guys that we are in a different location right now where the hatch is actually located.
And funny enough, Rockstar Games has this cutscene right here where the jetpacks fly outside of the silo and look at the air right there, it's all white and that's the same thing what's happening right here if you are actually under the map where the silo is located where actually not the hatch is located so it's another trick by Rockstar Games. I think you guys all know this place where I am walking right now. Look at this place right here. It looks like a garage and if you guys notice this, this is actually that scene if you win a match or actually when a match is over in GTA 5 online, when a match is over if you play a race, a dead match or something, you have this little cutscene right here. Look at that. Orange scene baby. I'm there in the back. Look at that, that's me. Oh my god, mom, get the camera! From this garage, and this is also found underneath the map. And look at those blue dots right here. If you guys know those blue circles, those blue circles are actually locations underneath the map. With mods, you are able to find them really, really easy, but they, those are hidden underneath the map. Now I'm gonna show you guys this one right here. This is like the mug shot from a player creation scene right here look at this right here I'm just gonna stand here as michael look at this if you play online and create a character this is the first thing you will see in gta 5 online So this is a comedy club called split sides and this comedy club is not even used in the game yet this comedy club right here has an interior but if you go to this comedy club you will notice that it's closed we haven't used this in story mode we haven't used this in online mode but there is an interior that's found underneath the map for this split sides comedy club and I'm gonna show you guys it right now so we are inside the split sides comedy club and I'm not taking credit for this it's been found a long time ago but the reason why I show this is it's found underneath the map it's not where it's supposed to be at that location on the street right there at the uh, Split Sides Comedy Club. No, it's not there. And a funny thing, like a uh, <laughs> funny thing right here is that I've been here in real life. Look at this. But this is so freaking amazing. Check this out. Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Nort. For our next location, we are under the map once again, and this is the 12 car garage that you can buy in GTA 5 online. Now there are many, many, many locations underneath the map that you actually can visit underneath the map. Like this is no joke. People actually made freaking custom games about locations that they found underneath the map. Now some locations need triggers and all that, but yeah, look at this right here. This is located at the square underneath the map on a location where it like shouldn't be. So this is very interesting. Like I said, I have many, many, many locations that I can show you guys, but I think this video will be uh, maybe boring or too long. I don't know. I don't know if you guys want to see more locations. Let me know in the comments below and I'll make maybe a part two of this. So to get back to the beginning of this video, once again, I didn't fake that video. I got comments saying and I even got people discussing about this. No, like Rockstar Games placed those interiors in places where it shouldn't be. And I was so freaked out and like I was like, like kind of shocked even. Like I was mind blown about the fact that Rockstar Games put the submarine underneath Mount Chiliad where it's not even water. Like you would supposed to think that somewhere out there in the ocean, but nope, they put it under Mount Chiliad. So yeah, I didn't fake that shit, like it's Rockstar Games placing those locations here and there where it shouldn't be. So yeah, I want to point that out once again. Should I make a part 2 of more locations that are found underneath the map or maybe unused locations because we also got a lot of that in Grand Theft Auto 5. Now I want to thank you guys for watching, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you drop a like on it if you enjoyed it and also if you are new. I want to see more GTA 5 videos, subscribe to my channel. I want to thank you guys and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye!